This is number 15 out of the first book of Practical Studies. We are in the key of F, so that means we have one flat, and that's B flat, first vowel. Our time signature is common time, so that's the same as 4-4, where the quarter note gets one beat. And we have a lot of repeated rhythms in this. So we have one, two, three, te, four, te, one, two, te, three, te, four. So that repeats for the first couple measures. And then it pretty much continues with rhythms that are, are not too complicated, either one, two, te, three, four, te, or one, two, three, four. Pretty simple rhythms. So as always, the first thing to get correct is the rhythms. And if that's not quite right, go back and count the rhythms out loud uh, to yourself in time so that you're making sure that you're getting the correct rhythm. The second step is always checking the melody so that your pitches are correct. So again, we have B flats, um, whether they're high or low, they're always gonna be flat unless marked otherwise. Um, and we do have one instance of that in the second line, second measure. There is a B natural, but then after that, it goes back to a B flat. Definitely pay attention to where the articulations are. Are you slurring? Are you tonguing? Um, at least for the first two measures, we have ta 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 ta. Um, so we had those groups of eighth notes that were slurred. Everything else was tongue. So be really conscious of where the articulations are. So now I will play it from top to bottom for you. You can either uh, look at your music and follow along with me, or go ahead and play along with me too. Uh -huh. 